I am developing a minimalist style, he told our English teacher, who complained that Owen never expanded a single point in any of his papers. He never employed more than one example for each point he made. First, you tell me I can't write using only capital letters. Now you want me to elaborate, to be more expansive. Is that consistent? He asked our English teacher. Maybe you want me to change my personality too. If at Gravesend Academy the voice had persuaded the majority of the faculty that his eccentricities and peculiarities were not only his individual rights but were inseparable from his generally acknowledged brilliance, the more diverse but also more specialised faculty at the University of New Hampshire were not interested in the whole boy, not at all. They were not even a community, the university faculty, and they shared no general opinion that Owen Meany was brilliant. They expressed no general concern that his individual rights needed protection, and they had no tolerance for eccentricities and peculiarities. The classes they taught were for no student's special development. Their interests were the subject themselves. Their passions were for the politics of the university, or of their own departments within it. And their overall view of us students was that we could, should, conform ourselves to their methods of their disciplines of study. Hmm?